guys, welcome to my video vlog. This will, be, this will be a full one today. As you see, I kind of did some little rearranging here, so so I don't have to get my my uh, game game case here. <laughs> so and here we're right here in the center, perfect spot. So let's all break it down. What happened this weekend? This week? Um, no NASCAR news. I've seen they had their awards banquet they had, but it's just red carpet pictures and all that stuff they had. And plus, series champion and all that stuff, so it was nothing too fancy, so yeah. But otherwise, I mean, I mean, it was nice. It was nice. And two, I don't think there's any drag news as far as I know. I didn't hear anything big happen, so. So otherwise, yeah. So let's get on to the results, which are right here. And as far as that, um, no, as far as off show news, yeah, nothing really big going on. So, yeah, nothing I can think of the top of my head that would, has been really huge or or what happened, you know. So, so otherwise, yeah, so let's, let's, let's get to, to Monday Night Raw. Line is on Raw, which has been a while. Oh, yeah, that's right, and uh, Becky and uh, Damage Control went on to an all-out brawl. She was a one-woman show. <laughs> and, she, and she took care of them all, and she took care of all three. So, anyway, so the first match was uh, Rhea, Rhea against Mia. And then it ended in no contest as the Judgment Day and the OC got involved in that match. So Then it was the OC versus the, the, the uh, Judgment Day. And that Judgment Day won. Which, which was a uh, mixed um, four man, I mean, eight man tag. So. And the Usos and Zane came out on the solo. Then Owens came out. And then Owens faces Jay, so. And then, uh, then Candice uh, 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 returned from injury, kind of brief injury. And the Street Profits face the Alpha Academy. Well, actually, the returning Street Profits, technically, and they won. Then Austin Theory came out. Kind of pretty much uh, feeding his feeding his own ego. And then Seth Rollins wants a wants a, a, a rematch for his U.S. title. Then the Miz was interviewed by Saxon carrying a bag of money. It says that he had an injured hand. Pierce asked him to stop and says the match will take place. So yeah, so it seems so it seems the the, the the Miz was trying to get out of a match because of a broken hand. Then it was Lewis faced the Miz and then Dexter got his revenge as the Miz tapped out to the vice. And then uh, Lewis was kind of given 
free uh, money to uh, young fans, and then the uh, last young fan, the uh, Miz, uh, took that uh, hundred dollar bill away, and then Johnny Gargano kicked him, and then then uh, then Emma uh, Dexter gave the uh, kid his his money back, <laughs> and so and I guess that Dexter and uh, Gargano have an alliance, kind of pulled away back in the in NXT. It was Kai versus Candice LeRae. And I gotta say, this was a pretty good match. Uh, I mean, I mean, uh, I mean, Candice looks like she was ready to go after an injury. So, and she got the win too. So, then Owens faced Jay. And Owens got the win. There you have it. We'll see what happens on Raw tomorrow, which we know some of the matches are going to happen tomorrow, and plus that open poker thing that JBL will have. Okay, okay. start with NXT. First match, Roxanne Perez defeated Indy Hartwell. Then the returning Dijak de de defeated Dante Chen. And then they had a WWE Hall of Fame panel announced. Uh, Iron Survivor Challenge with... X-Pac, Road Dogg, Shawn Michaels, Alondra Blaze, and Molly Holly on the panel. <laughs> so, so one side was DX, and the other side was former WCW women. <laughs> and the guy in the middle, of course. Yeah. And Grayson Waller defeated Duck Duke Hudson of Chase U. Then then Kena James defeated uh, a Henley Fowler Henley. And then Exxon defeated Javier Burnell, or Burnell. And uh, Julius Creed defeated J.D. McDonough. Then Von Wagner def de defeated Blade, Malik Blade. And Toxic Attraction defeated uh, the key Lions and, and uh, Carter and, 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 and Chance. There you have it. Here's NXT. See what happens next week. And on to AW Dynamite. The John Moxley music hit, yeah. And the show. Then, and then returning Hangman Page came, came back. And he, uh, he asks his, mostly as he wants to do this, do this after last time, and the hangman punches him and attacks him when they both brawl on the outside, and the security comes out to separate them. Okay, got a robbery going on between hangman and Moxley. Then Brian Danielson defeated, I mean, faced Dax Harwood, and he defeated Dax Harwood, which I almost said defeat the first time, sorry. But yeah, but he won. Locked in the bell lock. And Paige and Moxley can continue brawling. Then the TNT Championship, Joe faced A.R. Fox. Then Joe won, of course. Said he liked to. That Joe said he would. He would like to welcome ev everyone to the new era, as he is the new king on television. Okay, <laughs> many others have have said that, and uh, that doesn't feel like a new era.
Then, uh, well, then uh, Warlow appears on the Tintron, and then he said, "He is coming for what's his." So we just, which is kind of Joe. Then Regal came out, and he, and he introduces MGF. says that MJF can be the greatest villain. He, he then says MJF wants to be champion. He, uh, he must grab the brass ring. Bell needs an upgrade because it's tacky and reminds him of former champions. That's what MGF said. Then he he then says this version of the title is garbage, like like the crowd. Regal then uh, reveals the new championship belt. MGF says this is the most important world title in wrestling wrestling because he is he's gonna he is he's the one one holding it. He calls Ricky Starks a fake star. Then he calls Dan Bryan a fake wrestler. Sends a message to the locker room. And the, the, the company is going to be a world champion until the bidding war of 2024, where he he will use the title to get a a, a big money contract. Then he he says he hopes that Contra Blitch Foots the bill. <laughs> the, throwing in some WWE there. He's getting tired of, of looking at disgusting fans and hints at, at going to Hollywood. Fans call him Mystique Max because people who support will call him a, a repetitive and, and a coward. He says he is title reigns is going to be longer than Hulk Hogan, JBL, and Jeff Jarrett, and Bruno San Martino. Uh, Bruno San Martino? No. <laughs> no, not in this era. No. And he says, this is not possible without brass knuckles with Rio, and, and then he attacks Rio from behind with the brass knuckles. MGF says that, that Ringo made a deal with the devil. And Jeff leaves the ring and, and a head back through, through the crowd. And the Titanic Cook comes out on Ringo. Then uh, Ringo's out on, 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 on Stretcher. Yeah, because I heard a thousand ways, one of the ways they're going to run him off TV. Okay, the Ricky starts fair, faced Aria Davari and then Starks won. Then Willow Nightmare faced. Face Anna J A S and with a one, which was something. And then returning, well then returning, uh, Ruby Soho came back to attack Ty Mello. They match three out of the best of seven series of the AW World Trios Championship. Death Triangle faced the Elite, and who won? The Elite. Of course they're gonna win. Of course. And then ends Dynamite. Okay, on to SmackDown, which he came on early in my area. I watched the whole show. Yeah, and then Sammy, the, the, the uh, blonde came out with, with, with Zayn, the Usos, and Solo. And then was Zane faced Sheamus because because uh, Sheamus came out. And Zane won. Because Jay hit uh, Sheamus with super kick. God gave, gave Zane the win. And, and then uh Bray Wyatt gave another creepy promo. I 
Then Shannon Baszler faced Emma. Then Baszler won. Then Shotzi and uh, Rodriguez came out. So, yeah, to uh, uh, scare off uh, Baszler. Then Gunther faced Kobe Kingston. And Braun Strowman came out to even the odds. And either way, Gunther won. And then damage con control was in the ring. And uh, Liv, well then, and then Liv Morgan came out to, to take them all on. And then returning, Tegan Knox came back. And she's on the side of, of uh, Liv, so. And uh, Ricochet, the main event, the Ricochet faced uh, Santos Escobar with Fantasma at ringside, and they got kicked out. And the, and the match was, was pretty good. I got to give credit. As, uh, as uh, Ricochet won, and then Gunther showed up, and, yep, the build-up for the Continental title. All right, so on AEW Rampage, which I forgot it was on, guys. I forgot to watch a uh, Rampage. And then match one, Darby Allen faced Cole Carter. Excuse me that Darby's be be becoming Mr. Rampage. He's been doing a lot of shows lately on there. Then uh, Darby won. Then okay, in match two, Jay Lethal and Jeff Jarrett faced Private Party. And Jay Lethal and, 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 and Jarrett won. Even though it's something that Jarrett was... Uh, wrestling still. <laughs> but, but they won, though. P probably because Jay Lethal did do most of the work. Then Athena faces Danny Moe. And, of course, uh, well, Athena won, of course. Then the all then the NW All Atlantic title lumberjack match. Orange Cassidy faced uh, me with best friends faced QT Marshall, and then still champion Orange Cassidy won. And that's it for AW Rampage. Okay, there you go, guys. There is for wrestling results. Okay, now on to NFL. Well, Hawks got it done today against the Rams. Fans not so much. Yeah. They had a couple of chances. I was watching the game as well as long as I was watching the, the Hawks game, and fans had a couple of chances, but they just fell apart at the end. I mean, that's pretty much what it was with them. So, but yeah, the, the Hawks held on, and they got the W. So, in the other games, so Washington and the Giants uh, tied in overtime. Then uh, Philly beat Tennessee, 35-10. Then Minnesota beat the Jets. Then Cincinnati beat Kansas City by by three. Then Baltimore beat uh, beat uh, beat Denver. Sorry guys, I lost my track, my uh, space there. There is yeah yeah yeah. Baltimore beat beat Denver by by point, and and, and then uh, Pittsburgh beat Atlanta by three. And then Green Bay beat the Bears by tw twenty to nineteen. That the 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 rivalry. Well, then Detroit beat Jacksonville 40-14. Then the Raiders beat the Chargers by a touchdown. And then Cleveland beat Houston 0.714. All right, so you have it. And going on right now is the Colts and the Cowboys. And it's 10-7 second quarter. So, so yeah. So next week, see who has who next week. I went to the wrong spot. Dang it. Yeah. Yeah, the, the, the Dolphins game, yeah, too. I had that turnover. It really hurt. <laughs> so. Okay, so. Who has who here? It is. Seattle will play, play Carolina, and Miami will, will, play, will, 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 will play the, the Chargers. 
Sunday night, actually. So I'll be able to watch it. Awesome. And the Panthers and Hawks are at 125, so. Alright, see how it goes. See how it goes next week for them. And also in NBA Portland, they actually beat the Jazz last night in a big win after they, they lost maybe about four or five games in a row, so. So good. So good for Portland. Nice job for them. So. Then, nothing baseball, but college football, boy. Well, the bowl games are now set. And the thing that got me today is that, well, it's the finals of the college football playoffs, the, um, the ranks. And who was all in who. And I saw somehow TCU managed to stay in third after a loss to Kansas State. I can, see this, I, can see this, I can see this as a good thing because 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 Bama doesn't sink, sink, sink their way in. But it just seems that it didn't matter. Kansas State being TCU it just didn't matter for, for them to win. I mean, even though they won the conference championship, but for TCU, win or lose, hey, we're still in. You know? That's what it was. And, and it just didn't feel right. It just didn't feel right, but it's the way it is. And plus that, Bama's not in there, so 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 I got to look at that positive. But yeah, so it's otherwise. So anywho, under under the games from last week, uh, Buffalo beat Akron by one. Then uh, then uh, UTSA beat North Texas forty to twenty seven. Then uh, Utah won the Pac twelve championship, the messed up Pac twelve championship against USC. Then uh, t Toledo beat, beat Ohio by 10. Oh, and plus, by the way, on the USC and Utah, yeah, Caleb, their, their quarterback, he wrote on his fingernails, F Utah. Karma! Gets everybody. <laughs> I'm glad that happened. I really am. Next time, he won't do that. And then, yeah, so, yeah, Kansas State won by three in overtime. Then New Mexico State beat Val Porcero by 65-3, then Troy beat Coastal Carolina 45-26 in the uh, Sun Belt Championship, and then Georgia beat LSU by by 20, 50 to 30, and then Tulane beat UCF 45-28, then uh, Boise couldn't, couldn't get down the Mount West Championship game, they lost 28-16, then uh, Clemson beat, beat uh, North Carolina 39-10, then Michigan took care of Purdue 43-22. So... In the bowl games, I see here that Boise State's going to be playing in the Las Vegas Bowl against North Texas on the, I mean, I mean on the 17th. So, you have the Army, well, the Army and the Navy game next week. In, in the Bahamas Bowl, got Miami, Ohio face UAB. Then, in, hold on. Okay, hold on, guys. This doesn't look right. <laughs> okay. Let me get to the bowl games here, so. Alright. Oh, yeah, plus, yeah. Prime time. Sanders is going to be the new coach for Colorado. I actually saw that the, the, the yesterday, so. Here, uh, let me Google the, the bowl games because I'm not finding it on uh, Yahoo Sports. Okay. To college football bowl game zero. Okay, so the Bahamas Bowl, yeah, it's Miami and UAB. Then, then the Cure Bowl, number twenty-four Troy faces number twenty-five UTSA, and then the Fenway Bowl in Cincinnati versus Louisville. Ravry, uh, yeah, Ravry, <laughs> because of Cincinnati, Louisville. And then the Celebration Bowl, Jackson State faces NC uh, North Carolina Central. N New Mexico Bowl, SMU faces a a a a BYU. Then the then the uh, then the then the LA Bowl, Washington State faces Fresno State. Then the Lenning Tree Bowl, it's Rice versus versus Southern Mississippi. Then the Las Vegas Bowl, Oregon State's in it. Number fourteen, Oregon State faces Florida. 
There we go, finally. We got a Pac-12 team based on the SEC team in a bowl game. Now flipping time. <laughs> and well, then the uh, Frisco Bowl. Oh, okay. Okay, uh, so, so I was wrong on the Boys State and Las Vegas Bowl. That, that was wrong. Okay, so, so, so in the Frisco Bowl, it's Boys State versus North Texas. And then, then it's uh, then the uh, Myrtle Beach Bowl be between uh, Marshall versus UConn. And then the uh, famous Auto Potato Bowl, it's Eastern Michigan versus San Jose State. Then uh, Boca, Rat Tom Bowl, Liberty versus Toledo. Then the uh, New Orleans Bowl, South, Al South Alabama faces West Kentucky. Then the Armed Forces Bowl, Baylor versus uh, Air Force. And then the Guest Perilla Bowl, Wake Forest faces, faces Missouri. And then the, and then the Independence Bowl, Houston faces uh, Louisiana. Then, then the Hawaii Bowl, Middle Tennessee State versus San Diego State. And the Quick Lane Bowl is Bowling Green versus New Mexico State. Then the first re, re, and the first responder bowl, Memphis versus Utah State. The uh, Birmingham Bowl, Coast Carolina faces East, East Carolina. And, um, kind of rivalry there, it's a rivalry. Then the Cam, Camella Bowl, Buffalo faces Georgia Southern. Then the Guaranteed Rate Bowl, excuse me. Uh, Oklahoma State versus Wisconsin, and then in uh, the, the the military bowl, Duke versus UCF, and the Arkansas Bowl, one well, Liberty Bowl, Arkansas Bowl, Liberty Bowl, Arkansas faces Kansas, and the Holly Bowl. There's the Ducks. Number fifteen, Oregon faces North Carolina. So, so they're having on on the Ducks there, on the on December twenty eighth. And then on uh, Thursday, the Penn State Bowl, well, well, the 29th. It's a Minnesota face Syracuse, and then the Cheez-It Bowl, it's number 13, North Florida State versus Oklahoma. And then the Iowa Bowl, it's Washington. Number 12, Washington faces number 20, Texas. There you go, AFG. <laughs> and then on December 30th, the Orange Bowl, number 6, Tennessee faces face, uh, number, number 7, Clemson. And then the Dukes Mayo Bowl, number 23, North Carolina State faces Maryland. Then the Sun Bowl, it's uh, number 18, UCLA faces Pitt. And the Gator Bowl, it's number 19, South Carolina faces number 21, Notre Dame. And then the Arizona Bowl, Ohio faces Wyoming. And then Saturday, on December 31st, New Year's Eve, it's the Fiesta Bowl, the college football playoff semifinal between Michigan and TCU. And, and uh, then the Peach Bowl, the college football playoff semifinal, Georgia faces Ohio State. Also, no games on uh, New Year's Day. Well, that's something. Okay, so in the Music City Bowl, it's Iowa versus Kentucky. The uh, Sugar Bowl, it's Alabama versus Kansas State. And then the then the second, it's the Rila Quest Bowl. Number 22, Mississippi State versus Illinois. And then the Cit Citrus Bowl, LSU, number 17, LSU versus Purdue. Then, then the Combo Classic, number 10, USC faces number 16, Tulane. So there's USC's bowl game. And, th and then the Rose Bowl game. It's number Utah faces number 11, Penn State. So Penn State somehow got, got the way in there. And then the, the after that, on the 9th of January, it's the uh, finals of the College Football Playoffs in the National Championship game. So there you go. There you go. Okay, that's all the bowl games, guys. It seems the Army and Navy didn't make it to any of the bowl games, so I guess their game won't matter next week. So, All right, so there you have it, guys. There you have it. And on college basketball, um, yeah, the um, uh, Ducks lost today to uh, uh, UCLA, which they beat Washington, though. But, the, but they lost to number 21 UCLA by nine, so it's okay. I'm not too bummed out about it. But the one was Gonzaga, and boy, they had a close one with Baylor. I tell you what, didn't get the redemption from last year. I mean, well, the last time they faced each other, but... But uh, Gonzaga let them have that game because they scored two threes out. The Gonzaga easily defended, but yeah, they, they, I mean, I mean, uh, I mean, they pretty much threw away the game. But, but they had a chance though. They, I mean, I mean, they had a chance and and they didn't capitalize on it. So anyway, their next game's here. I'll check out the schedule. So I get all up here. All right. We have some. Upsets today, Virginia Tech beat North Carolina, number 18, then Nebraska beat number 7, Creighton, then uh, Northwestern beat Michigan State, 
Laboratory Michigan State. Alright. Get on here. Got 12. Let's see the Ducks have next. Oh, oh and USC beat uh, Oregon State by one. Wow. Okay, nothing on Monday. Tuesday, nothing. Wednesday. Four games, but no Oregon. And on Thursday, no games for Oregon. Washington first face Gonzaga on, 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 on Friday. So that's Gonzaga's next game. And Oregon faces Nevada on Saturday. That's their next game. All right, so see if there's any games for Gonzaga before Washington here. Oh, and plus, that's on Root Sports. Wow, I thought it'd be on, like, on ESPN. Some games on Wednesday, but no Gonzaga. Tuesday, some games, no Gonzaga. Monday, they, they actually face Kent State. Okay, so they have a game on Monday as well. All right, so there you have it, guys. For college basketball. There you have it. So, anyhow, um, plus updates, guys. I actually added some themes on my... Favorite video game music here. Let me uh, go back to it. I'll tell you what they are here. I kind of for forgot. So, here, just a second here. As I'll add the uh, playlist at me after I'm done with this video. So, okay. As soon as I find it, I'll tell you. Okay. time here. Okay, here we go. Mm. Mm. I'm seeing new. What does it do? Uh, the uh, Tecmo NBA Basketball um, NES uh, music, the menu. I like that theme in, in, in the 8 bit. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. I think so. I'm going to take a look down the rest of these. I don't think I had any new, new any wrestling ones. No, I didn't. So, alright, guys, there you have it for my playlist updates. So, you know what time it is. It's time to read your comments. Starting with Evan Pittman for, on my NASCAR Heat 4 career part 7. You want four more races so far. You've got ninth. Nine career truck wins and, and a truck series championship. Congratulations. Thanks. And same guy, same game, different, same mode, uh, part nine, part two, where I had that error from, from yesterday. Your 14th career dirt win at Eldora. Perfect job. Okay, then same guy, same game, same career, part nine, part part one, be, be, uh, before I had that error. You got your first career, uh, I mean, uh, uh, you got your first career, x series, win at Bristol. Congratulations. Would have been second if I didn't block uh, the uh, number 23 at the uh, uh, Metaldega. Then Budamania, come in and ask for Heat 4 career part 8. Top top 10 at Texas. Nice job. Again, that same guy, same game, same mode, part 9, part 1. Nice. Nice race at Bristol, hey man. Again, same guy, same mode. Same game, part nine, part two. Nice race, outdoor hit man. And that's it for the week. There you go. <laughs> yeah, I mean, not many lately, so. Okay, let's check out my stats. My weekly stats here. To it. Wait for load. Okay, there we go. Okay, so. Seems that my. Yep it, it, yep, it jumped up. My su 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 subscribers have jumped up to 5678. Yep, 5678 subscribers. Thank you guys very, very, very much. Okay, my top content from the last 28 days. Give me my top 10. Yes, of course, my Insta Football 2006 intros with 483. And then, then my Insta Football 07 intros with 
with, with 543, and then NASCAR Test 3 Lightning Challenges at 447. And then fourth is NASCAR Test 5 Chase of the Cup Intros at 444. And then it's the NASCAR Test 3 PS2 with 315. And then sixth is WCF Universe Raw 2008 PS3 with 300. And then seventh is NCAA, NCAA Football 2004 with 280. And then then, then 8th is NCAA Football 10, PS3 with 267. Then 9th is W2K17, PS3 with 242. And then 10th is NASCAR doesn't live in the game, part 1. So, I have to see who is 12th in... I mean, I mean 11th and 12th. So, you can see here. Okay. Oh, dang it. Come on. Here, there. <laughs> I mean, it wasn't cooperating with me. And the one behind NASCAR Test 11, the game part one, is NASCAR 08 PS2 part one with uh, 192. And then behind that is, is Miami City Football 2006 with 191. All right. So thank you, guys. Top 12 right there. So, okay. So the content. All right. Go with all. Yeah, I got a live. And mostly my videos are against... Viewed, and most of my videos are being found on YouTube search still. Thank you guys. Next to, I mean, it's close with the uh, suggested videos. It's great, and then browse features is not far behind. So awesome. Okay. Alrighty, there's that. The audience. Mostly all the United States. <laughs> it hasn't changed either. And still, my not subscribed is still getting more views. So, which is fine. That's okay. And if it males, most of you are uh, watching my videos. Which I'm cool with that. As others, I I'm in. Then a user specified zero. <laughs> and then the ones have been in the age groups, it's 18 and 24 years who've been watching my videos the most. So, it's cool. Alright, so there you go, guys. There you have it on all that, on my stats. So, yep, there you have it. So, my stream schedule this week, guys. Monday, for sure. Tomorrow. And then, also Saturday, I am, which I am, which I am not going to do it on Friday because I'll go back to my regular shifts. So, yeah, so... So, so yeah, so, it's, so we're going back on Monday and, and, and Saturday this week. We'll be doing, doing the morning house car uh, heat four, so, career, so, we dig, dig into more of that. So, and plus, I think I'll be playing on my uh, small TV, because since my big TV keeps having those blackouts every now and then, so I think I'm just going to play it on my small TV, and, and uh, hopefully I'll go better than my regular TV, my big TV, so. So, anyways, yeah, so... And that's pretty much it. Uh, nothing else much to say. What's been going on? Um, so yeah. And plus, I got some snow today in my town. Yep. Had had a had a uh, just had a little bit of a trace of snow on the ground, and again more. It's actually snowing right now outside. So so yeah. First taste of first taste of snow, and who knows what's going to be like during the whole season for me here. So it's okay. I mean, it's typical weather winter weather. What can you do? So, big, 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 well, that's for some of you who actually live up in the north. You're actually used to it, in either way. So, yeah. So, guys, yep, that's it. That's it, all of that. So, hope you all tune in my live stream tomorrow, and I'm done. So, from that guy who has over 5,000 subscribers and lives in Pelton, Oregon, I'm out of here. Take care, guys.